Hey, welcome back to Clean Cut, where we can talk about the truth about just about anything, as long as we use logic and common sense. This season, we're talking about prayers, and now we'll be talking about the prayer that's said during the Sacrament of Reconciliation, the Act of Contrition. Like the Confidior, this is a prayer about having sinned and being sorry for it. The Act of Contrition has a few versions. I'll be picking one that seems appropriate and not going over the others, at least for now. You can find them all online, though, if you look for them. In any case, this isn't the version that I first learned when I was young. My God, I am sorry for my sins with all my heart. We address the prayer to God, acknowledging that we've committed sins and apologizing for doing so, which is as good a place to start as any. In choosing to do wrong, and failing to do good, I have sinned against you, whom I should love above all things. As it says in the first commandment, we should love God first over everything else. Because of this, when we make decisions that go against the will of God, we do wrong and fail to do right. That's what sin is, ultimately. I firmly intend, with your help, to do penance. We have a very strong intention to do whatever penance is given to us in order to demonstrate our sincerity in being sorry for our sins, but even for that we depend on God to help us. To sin no more. If there's anything we need God's help for, it's this. Sinning no more is a very rare achievement in this life, exceptionally difficult to do. And to avoid what leads me to sin. This means that if we know that something normally harmless will tempt us into committing a sinful act, alcohol, for example, is one thing that some people have a problem with, then we want to avoid the normally harmless thing in order to also avoid the temptation and the sin that it leads us towards. Our Savior, Jesus Christ, suffered and died for us. We acknowledge that Jesus is the Messiah and our Savior. We also acknowledge that he suffered and died in order to assist us. In his name, my God, have mercy. Finally, a plea for God to show mercy on us, poor sinners. Next time, aside from the rosary, do any other prayers use the Hail Mary? That's all for now, so keep asking questions, and thanks for watching.